Hey guys, my name's Dan, and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to do a basic matte painting set extension in After Effects. Um, in my case I've got this scene here of a pan across a field with this view of the city in the background, and I wanted to add some sort of floating sky city up in here somewhere. Um, I found one just on Google Images, typed it in, I then brought it into Google seems to be crashing on me. I did. I didn't brought it in onto Photoshop and just got rid of the background and saved it as a PSD and then brought it into After Effects. Um, your footage, of course, will be completely different, and you'll want to bring something else into it: uh, buildings, clouds. Um, this technique uh, it works for all of those things. Uh, you just have to tailor it to your needs, really. Uh, so we start here, you've got your clip. The first thing you want to do is track the footage. Um, my footage was on a tripod, so it's not too shaky. It's just a little bit wobbly. So I'll just track the position. But if yours is handheld, I would suggest clicking the rotation as well, as this will help improve the track. Um, so I'll go ahead and click Analyze Forward and let it do its thing. Okay, now that the track's finished then, um, I'll bring it start back to the start of the clip. You want to add a new null object and click on edit target and make sure null layer is selected. Then you want to apply all the tracking data to that null. So hopefully now null will be tracked to our scene, which it looks like it is. This is the point where it will bring in my Photoshop layer of Cloud City. Uh, go to the point in the video where you want it to be. I sort of want mine out here. I'll scale it down a little bit, make it look like it's off in the background there a bit. Maybe add a fast blur just to make it appear as like slightly out of focus for maybe three just to yeah make it look like it's a bit out of focus and the key here now is to parent that layer to the null object and so now it's part of our scene uh, that is pretty much the most basic matte painting I think you can do. Um, you can of course um, improve it by a color correction. Uh, for this one I'll just add an adjustment layer then add green easy preset from Video Copilot and then so now we've got a footage tracked, color graded pretty much done. Um, it can get a lot more complicated than this. Like I said, this is the most basic form I think you can probably do. Um, uh, you can have m so many things in one scene. Uh, but the key is to make sure they're all they're, it's, the footage is tracked well and all your things are um, parented to that tracking data. Well I hope this helped a little bit for uh, all of you who are new to map painting, set extensions, that sort of thing. Uh, you'll probably you can probably you'll find plenty of more advanced tutorials out there for you if this information wasn't enough. Um, so but hopefully it did help a little bit. Um, I will speak to you soon in another tutorial.